What is going on guys, you're back with Friendly Liam Key and today we're going to be doing an update on our Fallout Shelter video. Fallout Shelter, Vault 28. So in the last episode we left with two pregnant ladies, a low water supply, and two incoming vault dwellers, that's cool. Okay, well, I think our first order of business is to find Nicole, we found her. We were told to call the child, Calvin. The great, and then we spell great completely strangely. All right. Okay, it will just have to be Calvin Great. Grat. Up. Oh, too long. Calvin, it shall be. Grat. No, that's not how you spell grat. Ooh, I'm not doing too well today, guys. <coughs> Up, oh, Timothy Clark. Oh, and Randy Clark is dead. That sucks. Okay, we're gonna have to. Oh, look at that. I had set up an additional two uh, vault dwellers to get busy while we were away. Now I just gotta try to remember where they go. Sorry about the long time waiting. I am busy with projects at the moment. Hmm. And you can work there, so that's cool. Up, oh, yep, Randy Clark is dead, guys. So we're gonna revive him right now. We're gonna call him back here yeah? because it looks like a wolf still stands to gain 100 caps of his death. So that's pretty neat. Let's have a look here. Danielle Anderson. Woo! Danielle, Danielle, Danielle. What mess did you get yourself into? Emma Scott. Ooh, I'm so happy that they updated the names. Like, wow. Oh, dear. I'm sorry, Emma. You're going to have to die. Yes, kidding. We'll, we'll figure something out for you, boo. Up, oh, and we unlock two more rooms. The science lab and the overseer's office. That's awesome. Means we can start doing quests soon. Just want to wait. I think let's build... An additional quarters, bay. Oh, I know, I know. Things get more and more expensive the more we have. Oh, and she's got a two in in intel in intelligence. In intelligence, she's got a two, guys. No, she's got a two in intelligence, so she'll fit quite nicely inside of the Stimpak creation bay, I reckon. And you, you need a weapon. Danielle Anderson, you are officially super geared for the apocalypse. I'm going to give you the lab coat. Yeah. That's not good. It's not good at all. I feel we're going to have to quickly try and rush them because we're running out of time. Oh my god. Yes. Whew. That should save us for a little bit, guys. Same with this room. I'm going to have to upgrade it. Oh no. I need Clark. How far is Clark out, guys? Okay, so we've got two more pregnant women. And I think we actually need to set up an additional two. That way we have a slow increase, you know, it's nothing too drastic. Problem is, I don't want there to be reoccurring father. Jeffrey King. Sounds like a man's name. Yeah, I see, we're already out of power there. That's not good. It's not good. Okay. I think... Blonde Danielle over here. And. Okay, we're gonna be a little bit dramatic here. Samuel is gonna cheat on Nicole with. Oh, never mind. Never mind, guys. Samuel and Nicole can have their second child. There's no cheating here, there's only loyal. Loyalty. Should be calling this fault. The Vault of Loyalty. Let's see if there's any challenges that we can quickly tackle. Okay, so we're so close to collecting 100 water. 
there's no ways in hell I'm selling a weapon or outfit yet. <coughs> Actually, I take that back. There is one I can sell, and I'll explain it to you now. And collect 100 power. Yeah, we're close on those. So I actually hate the uh, junior officer uniform. It just seems really pointless to me. Especially, it, it only grants you one additional charisma and two ad additional intelligence, right? You can get both of those from the lab coat and the nightwear. You know, so it, it becomes a little bit obsolete. Up, do we? No, no, we don't get enough. Damn it, guys. It's okay. Raise the happiness of one dweller to 100%. Well, I can already tell you one of these people are going to be very happy real soon. Yep, she's going to be real happy. It's because the moment you have a child or you are pregnant, you automatically become instantly happy. You know what I'm saying? Boop. Got that one. We're almost there. Almost, almost there. Let's quickly take uh, Laura. Slap her in there as well. Actually, wait. We'll wait for Tom. And, oh, Tom Hardy. Who who read who read those books? Leave in a comment in the comment section down below if you have read Tom Hardy books. Uh, Samuel and Nicole Hardy. Once they're done, then I'll send in Laura and her future lover, who I have not decided yet who is who. Yeah, no, they were just like the first two people that I actually saw. If only Randy Clark, uh, yeah, we don't even have any like Nuka Quantum to help speed him up, you know. We need you, Randy. Randy, we need you. Yay. Okay, so we've got two pregnant dwellers, so we've got 19 plus 2, so that makes it, what, 21? Then plus these two, it'll be 22, 23, so we need one more to make it even. And I believe our vaults only takes 28 people, so that's fine. I'd rather increase it slowly, because, oh gosh, come on, man. Would it kill these two to just get going, man? I mean... We're about to run out of power, people. Laura, you're needed. You as well. Sandra, Amanda. Oi, names. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to call it there. I'm going to leave you in a little bit of suspense of the low power situation. Oh, look. She just... Amanda just leveled up. Yay. So I'm going to leave you there in suspense and limbo. You know, we've got dwellers who are about to get busy. We've got, we're about to run out of power. You can already see the meta bay is, it's, it's shutting down. So we're slowly starting to run out of space. Randy Clark had to be revived. He died outside. And yeah, thanks again for coming in and tuning with me, guys. Please like and subscribe. It really does help me out. And uh, it lets me know that you guys are enjoying the content that I'm producing, if you do enjoy this. And uh, yeah, have a great one. Uh, cheers.